Hi everybody, welcome to Fiction and Digital and I'm Monica and today I have September's Bookcase Club box. Um, if you don't know what this is, it is a monthly subscription box that gives you two books from the genre of your choice. Mine is the Thrill Seeker box because I like to read those kind of books. So it is $9.99 per month with $5 shipping. I got a six month subscription and um, I paid for it on my own. Nobody gave it to me just because I like the box, the subscription box that I've seen other people do unboxings. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, I had already cut it open and right there you get to see the books. They always give you a cute little card. And it says book shimmy to, ri to rhythmically move the shoulders back and forth when talking about or holding a book. The unrestrained physical manifestation of one's enthusiasm and appreciation for the book. They always write a cute little note in here. And it gives you the name of the person who actually put your box together. And Crystal put this together for me. So, first book we have is by Chevy Stevens and it's called That Night. It is a nice hardback book. So let's go ahead and see what the inside says. It says, as a teenager, Tony Murphy had a life full of typical adolescent complication, a boyfriend she adored, a younger sister she couldn't relate to, a strained relationship with her parents, and classmates who seemed hell-bent on making her life miserable. Things weren't easy, but Tony could have never predict how horrific they would become until her younger sister was brutal, brutally murdered one summer. Wow. So, it sounds like a mystery thriller about her sister. And, from what I can see, is as she gets older, when she's 34, she goes back to her home downtown to try to figure out what happened. This is exactly the kind of book I love to read. So, I will be getting to this as soon as possible and possibly doing a review on this. Hopefully, I can get to a lot of the reviews. I'm way behind on some of them. So, the second book we have is a paperback and slightly smaller. And this one is Don't Bother Me by Jason Miller. So, I haven't heard of him either. But, let's read the back and see what it says. In the depths of the Nighthawk, one of the last working collaborators in downstate Illinois, the body of a reporter is found. His mini recorder is tied around his neck and a notepad stuffed in his mouth. Nice. Uh, the Nighthawk's owner, Matthew Lester, isn't happy. He wants answers, and he doesn't want the cops or any more press poking around his business. To protect himself and the operation, he turns into Slim, a mine employee with a reputation of bloodhounding, finding lost souls when the police can't or won't. Less than he's slim to locate a missing photographer named Beckett, a close associate of the victim, who just happens to be his son-in-law. So this sounds like a really great thriller of a whodunit. And something I could probably get through pretty quickly because since it's not too thick, and it should be a fr fr fairly easy fast read. So, once I get through this one, I'll probably have another review. If I do all the reviews I'm supposed to have, that would be a video a day, hopefully, or yeah. something like that. We're going to try to get everything down to a rhythm and get as many books as I can done and as many videos as I can get up. So, until October's, which I hope has a lot of Halloween things, I'll see you later. Bye.